Hello and welcome to Learning in Technology. My name is Frank and I'm glad that you're here. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to create an organizational team in Microsoft Teams. This video is part of a larger series of videos that I'm creating on Microsoft Teams to help you get up to speed and feel comfortable using the tool. I'll also create a video on how to create a classroom team, which is very similar to creating an organizational team. But let's go have a look at how I can create an organizational team to get started with great collaboration. Let's create a team. Right now I'm on a organizational version of Microsoft Office 365 as opposed to an educational institute. So if I go in here, when I first install Teams, I can put a code. So each team will generate a code that I can give out. So if someone else has created a team, they can give me a code to enter in there. Or I can create my own team. And when I go to create a team, I can create a team from scratch or I can use it from an existing Office 365 group or team that already exists. I'm going to go ahead and build mine from scratch and it's going to either allow me to create a private uh, group or team that I need to invite people to join or a public one where everybody in the organization can join or an organization one where everybody's automatically put into it. I'm going to create a private one so that I can show you the act of how I would invite people into that team. So I'm going to go in here and I'm going to call this, let's say we'll call this save the world. This team is going to work on a project. So it's save the world project. We're going to save the world and uh, a team to save the planet. Okay. And we'll create this team. So it's going to create the team. And right now I'm the only person in the team. So I've got, you know, congratulations to me. I created a team, but now we have to put some, some members in here. So I'm going to put in uh, Clark Kent. We'll put him in the team and we'll put in, uh, let's put in Bruce Wayne. These are people in my organization and we'll put in Peter Parker and we'll put in Albert Einstein is going to be part of my team and uh, a friend of mine, Bender Rodriguez, and we'll put in Diana Prince in there as well. So we have a whole number of people that I put into my team and they're all now added into that team. Now, when they log into their teams, they'll also be able to, to see this team save the world project. Notice right now that they're all members of the team. I can also go in and make them an owner. Now, if I'm in an academic environment, that will be uh, the ability to make them a teacher. So I can have teachers and students and guests. I'll, I'll do another demonstration where I show you creating an academic team. But there we go with my organizational team. And now I can go in, I can add more people. Notice that it begins with the name of the team and a general channel. And I can also open up uh, information or frequently asked questions about the team. There you have it. We have our own team. We're ready to go. We're ready to start collaborating. There are a lot of other things that we're going to do with Microsoft Teams, and I'm going to create videos on all of those different aspects. But now we have the core element, a team. We now can have people invited into it. We can start building discussion groups. We can start building channels. There, there's a lot of things we can do. We can have meetings. Uh, if you find this interesting, go ahead and hit the like button. If you want to see some of the things we can do with Teams and some of my subsequent videos, then you really should subscribe and you should hit the notification bell so that you're notified as I release new videos. I'm really excited to get everybody up to speed on Teams and I hope you're excited to join me on that journey. Thank you so much for watching. I'll post some links to some other videos that I have on the channel. Please leave any comments down below on anything that you'd like to see, and we'll see you in the next video.